Amanda Blake, a notable figure in classic Hollywood, left a lasting impact through her works. Whether it's a particular moment that resonates with you or the first time you encountered her iconic presence on screen, Blake's contributions to the industry are undeniably memorable. We invite you to share your most cherished memories or personal experiences related to this classic Hollywood actor in the comments below. Stay tuned as we unravel funny, shocking, and sad facts about her. Keep watching and we'd love to hear your stories. Amanda Blake's filmography is a treasure trove of classic Hollywood gems showcasing versatile talent and enduring charm. For those new to her work, diving into the filmography is a journey through the golden era of cinema. One of her standout projects is the iconic TV series Gunsmoke, where she portrayed the spirited and memorable Miss Kitty. The show, spanning two decades, remains a must-watch for fans, offering a glimpse into the Old West with gripping storytelling and compelling characters. In addition to TV success, notable appearances in films left an indelible mark. Stars in My Crown is a cinematic gem where her performance shines, depicting a small-town doctor's challenges with heartfelt sincerity. Another noteworthy film is A Star is Born, a classic that showcases her ability to captivate audiences in diverse roles. For those eager to explore the filmography further, High Noon is a timeless western featuring her in a supporting role that adds depth to the narrative. Her on-screen presence, even in supporting characters, is a testament to her skill in leaving a lasting impact. If you're a newcomer, consider starting with Gunsmoke to witness her enduring legacy and then explore films like Stars in My Crown and A Star is Born to appreciate her range as an actress. High Noon offers an additional layer to her repertoire, making it a must-see for enthusiasts. The filmography is a rich tapestry of classic Hollywood and each project contributes to a lasting legacy in the world of entertainment. Whether it's the dusty streets of Gunsmoke or the emotional depth of Stars in My Crown, her work continues to resonate with audiences, inviting them to explore the captivating landscape of classic cinema. Amanda Blake, the revered actress of classic Hollywood, faced the unrelenting pressure to maintain a youthful appearance throughout her career. The entertainment industry's demand for eternal youth placed a burdensome weight on her shoulders, pushing her to navigate the delicate balance between age and the ever-demanding standards of Hollywood. In the quest to stay young, she encountered significant struggles common to many in the public eye. The constant scrutiny of her physical appearance and societal expectations of perpetual youthfulness undoubtedly added challenges to her journey. This pressure, often silent but palpable, highlights the unforgiving nature of an industry that prioritizes youth over experience. Beyond the relentless pursuit of youth, her life was marked by various personal and professional challenges. Navigating the entertainment world, coupled with the demands of maintaining a successful career, brought forth a myriad of trials. Yet, through it all, she showcased resilience, leaving an enduring mark on the classic Hollywood landscape. The timeless allure of her performances, particularly in iconic projects like Gunsmoke and Stars in My Crown, reflects not only her acting prowess, but also her ability to connect with audiences on a profound level. Her journey, filled with highs and lows, serves as a testament to the tenacity required to thrive in the dynamic world of entertainment. In the face of societal pressures, personal struggles, and the ever-evolving landscape of the entertainment industry, her legacy endures. Her ability to transcend the challenges of her time and leave an indelible impact on classic Hollywood solidifies her place in the annals of cinematic history. Amanda Blake's life took a challenging turn in 1980 when she was diagnosed with oral cancer, a consequence of smoking two three-packs of cigarettes daily. Despite the uphill battle, she faced the adversity head-on and underwent oral cancer surgery in 1984. Her resilience earned her the Courage Award from the American Cancer Society, presented in Washington, District of Columbia by President Reagan. The following year, Blake received the Sword of Hope Award, further acknowledging her strength in the face of a formidable foe. Tragically, her health journey took another turn, leading to her eventual demise. The cause of death, as stated on her certificate, was cardiopulmonary arrest due to liver failure and cytomegalovirus hepatitis. Dr. Lou Nishimura from Sacramento revealed that CMV hepatitis is AIDS-related, pointing to the possibility that she contracted the virus from her last husband, Mark Spieth, who also succumbed to complications of the disease. Spieth, an openly bisexual member of the Austin, Texas City Council, passed away in 1985. Amanda Blake's life, marked by personal and health struggles, 
unveils a narrative that goes beyond the glitz of classic Hollywood. Her battles with cancer and AIDS shed light on the human side of an industry that often prioritizes glamour over the harsh realities faced by its stars. Her legacy, tarnished by the shadows of illness, is a stark reminder of the challenges individuals endure behind the scenes, even those who have left an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. Amanda Blake's journey in the entertainment industry led her to a place of recognition among the Hall of Great Western Performers at the National Cowboy and Western Heritage Museum in 1968. Her induction solidified standing in the world of classic Hollywood, acknowledging contributions to the genre. Before securing the iconic role as Miss Kitty on Gunsmoke in 1955, she shared living quarters with Jan Shippard. It was a period preceding her breakthrough when navigating the challenges of the industry. Notably, before stepping into show business, she worked as a telephone operator, a role that preceded the climb to fame. The Hollywood landscape, however, wasn't always glittering. The unyielding demand for eternal youth placed considerable pressure. Navigating this challenging terrain, she faced the constant scrutiny of appearance, a silent struggle inherent to many in the public eye. Yet, resilience shone through, leaving an indelible mark on classic Hollywood. In 1980, confronting a different kind of challenge when diagnosed with oral cancer, a consequence of a heavy smoking habit. The uphill battle led to oral cancer surgery in 1984. Her strength in facing adversity earned the Courage Award from the American Cancer Society, presented by President Reagan. The following year, she received the Sword of Hope Award, further acknowledging tenacity in the face of a formidable foe. Tragically, the health journey took another turn, leading to eventual demise. The cause of death, as stated on the certificate, was cardiopulmonary arrest due to liver failure and cytomegalovirus hepatitis. The possibility of contracting the virus from her last husband, Mark Spieth, added a somber layer to the narrative. Life, beyond the glitz of classic Hollywood, unfolds a human side marked by personal and health struggles. Battles with cancer and AIDS illuminate the challenges faced behind the scenes, reminding us of the harsh realities endured by those who've made lasting contributions to the world of entertainment. Amanda Blake, widely recognized for her role as Miss Kitty Russell on Gunsmoke, left an enduring mark on classic Hollywood. In 1961, a notable business move saw her selling residual rights to Gunsmoke for a substantial $100,000, reflecting strategic career and financial planning. Her tenure on the iconic TV series spanned almost a third of her life, exemplifying the longevity of the association. Even in 1987, a triumphant return in the TV movie Gunsmoke Return to Dodd showcased her lasting connection to the character defining an era. Beyond the glitz of Hollywood, challenges emerged. In 1980, she confronted oral cancer, a consequence of a heavy smoking habit. Despite the uphill battle, surgery in 1984 demonstrated remarkable resilience, earning her the Courage Award from the American Cancer Society presented by President Reagan. The subsequent Sword of Hope Award acknowledged her tenacity in facing a formidable foe. Tragically, her health journey took an unexpected turn, leading to her eventual demise. The cause of death, cardiopulmonary arrest due to liver failure and cytomegalovirus hepatitis, added a somber layer to her narrative. The possibility of contracting the virus from her last husband, Mark Spieth, who succumbed to AIDS-related complications, revealed the harsh realities faced by those who've made lasting contributions to the world of entertainment. Her induction into the Hall of Great Western Performers at the National Cowboy and Western Heritage Museum in 1968 stands as a testament to significant contributions to the genre. Before her breakthrough as Miss Kitty, she navigated industry challenges, sharing living quarters with Jan Shepard. Pre-showbiz days included working as a telephone operator, highlighting the journey preceding her climb to fame. In the face of societal pressures, personal struggles, and Hollywood demands, Amanda Blake's legacy endures. The ability to transcend challenges and leave a lasting impact on classic Hollywood solidifies a place in the annals of cinematic history, showcasing the human side behind the glittering facade of the entertainment industry.